Hello guys! In this video, we're going to talk about how to automate data collection using WebScrape AI. But before I begin, please hit that like button to show us your support and help our videos reach more people. Now let's get started. Do you know that there's an AI tool that can help you scrape data from websites without even knowing how to code? Web scraping is a process of collecting data from a website, such as collecting product names or prices from an e-commerce site. Although it can be done manually, it will take so much time, but it can be done at a faster rate using tools. Web Scrape AI is a user-friendly AI tool that is used to help users collect data from web pages. It's easy to use. Just look for the URL that you will use to scrape data from, copy the URL link, and paste it into the tool, and you'll get the results that you need. And the AI will use that web page to look for data that you'll instruct it to find. The best thing about this tool is that you don't need to learn about coding to understand the process of web scraping and get results. Now go to the URL webscrapeai.com. You need to have an account so click on the free trial button. Once you fill out the form, log in to your account. When you've logged in for the first time, you need to input your OpenAI API key in this text field. First, you need an account on openai.com. Log into your account on OpenAI, then click on your profile and choose View API Keys. Now you need to create a new secret key here and write a name for your secret key. Once you've generated one, Copy and paste them in this section. Now click on the Web Scrape AI tab. On this tab, you can enter a URL to use for your web scraping. You can type in the URL here. Next, write which part of the page you'd like to scrape for data collection. To give you an idea of what you should input, click this button to view an example URL, article title, external URL, and an example CSS selector. Below, you can collect data and export it as text, JSON, CSV file, HTML, and you can view the output cost. And let's use these data. Under which part to scrape, we can use the book title, author, and external URL. Now click on the button, submit. You can see that it is processing our request. Now it generated the book titles, the author, and external URL in this text field, in this window. You can copy and paste the text on your notepad, like what you see here. Now let's click on the JSON tab. If you look at the JSON file, it's also possible to copy this if you need a JSON file for this data collection. Now let's check out the CSV tab. Below, you can view more buttons such as new row or new column. Let's click on the export CSV button. Now it generated a downloadable CSV file. Now you can click on the download link, and as you open the file, the list of book titles, authors, and external links is shown here. Now let's use another example. Let's use a website where there are online courses available. Let's use this website. Copy and paste the URL link here. Then include each element to scrape. Now click Submit. You can see that here's the generated text file and we can copy and paste it again on our notepad. Now we can export the CSV file and download it on our computer. Now open the file and you can view the data we have collected in Excel file. You can also view the HTML tab and copy the results if you need to use it as your HTML page. Now let's use an e-commerce site and navigate to a category of products where we can collect data. Copy the URL from these codes, let's select the title section. We can use the product item title here. Now click on the submit button, and here are the data collected. Now let's try to add the price for each product. Going back to this page, look for the name of the product in this window. Then look for the price and check how it is named in this section. Now it shows the price of each product item title, and it also shows the external link where you can find that product. Now click on the CSV tab. Below, let's export the CSV file, then click download. Open the file, and you can see the elements, such as the product item title, the price, and the external link. So that's it for today's video. 
But before the video ends, here's something you shouldn't miss. If you need to create landing pages, funnels, lead pages in just a few clicks, we have a marketing app that can help you build a successful online business. You can create beautiful web pages, click and modify, and you don't need to learn how to do coding. You can create funnels with upsells, downsells, or order bumps. You can grab leads and send emails using cloud funnels. It also supports all major payment gateways, and you can offer memberships to your customers. So try Cloud Funnels now. Go to the URL, yournextfunnel.in. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.